Hey guys, Gold Rider here, and today I am playing Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Now, I first of all want to show off um, the new DLC pack that they have and talk a little bit about it. Um, this is the new DLC pack. It's the Steam pa it's the Steampunk pack, and it's pretty cool. Um, I am a bit I am a bit upset because the thumbnail thing that they have for the in the PlayStation Store for this pack shows him with a brand new hat. And this badass bl black engine glove, um, which you can see right here. This does not, but um, this is upgraded. I've upgraded the items, and they are just as good as um, this. Like, if you see this, even at its very best, this is the best gauntlet in the game. And even if you upgrade it entirely, it's only it's exactly the same as this one upgraded. And this each of these packs, like with this pack, everything is available at level 7. Um, as you can see here, this actually has full damage, full speed, full quick shot accuracy, and only minus two on the clip size. So, is this is the gun. I think it looks amazing. It's so cool looking. I, I just love it to death. Um, and also, obviously, the outfit. Now, I'm pretty sure you cannot change colors in this. No, it's one of the outfits that you can't change colors on, but... Basically, when you have it, it increases your voltaic bomb damage by 20%. Um, and it has, it still has the traditional top hat, so the black top hat with the red rim, um, which I was a bit depressed about because, as I said earlier, the thumbnail depicted it with a badass steampunk style hat. But, you know, I'm not going to bitch over it. Um, also, right here, this is the wallop enhancifier, which once upgraded becomes the best weapon in the game as far as your fists go. As far as fisticuffs go, the wallop enh enhanced fire is just as good, if not a little bit better than the best. Yeah, it actually, I'm pretty sure it's, it does one better in, oh no, no, it's exactly the same as the very best. And again, it's unlocked at level seven. So you don't have to wait until level 10 now to get the great gear, which I think is just awesome. Also, they have a belt, um, which, Let's see here. Yeah, it's this one right here. It's the fisticuffing, bu fisticuffing belt. And as you can see, if I upgrade this, which I can't right now because I don't have enough money. If I upgrade it, it gives me full defense and plus two stealth, which is amazing spat. Which is amazing specs. Like, frankly, this DLC pack, as far as specs go, is just amazing. I love it. Um, Let's see. I can't switch to Eevee right now, otherwise I'd show you, but... Uh, basically, I'm going to wear this costume, and I'm going to go through one of the DLC packs, which is the, um, the Dreadful Crimes DLC pack, which you can get for free on PlayStation 4 right now, I'm pretty sure. Um, it's also part of the, yeah, it's the, it comes with 10 crimes. This is, I believe, the fifth crime? I'm not sure, so we're actually going to go through, um, this man is Byron Cashins, and I don't know anything about this, uh, particular one yet. I just started the mission, so let's start off. Okay, no sign of a struggle, no wounds. So this man, this is called like the um, locked to death, and basically, from what the name implies, this guy died. It this guy just died in a locked room without anyone there. But this is interesting because it brings back the Unity style um, investigation tactics, and in that if you use Eagle Vision, the items that you need to investigate glow. And then you can actually look at them, and it's amazing. Um, letter from Cassian Byron, you old rogue. Your evisceration of the Aldwich group was delicious. Our readers cannot get enough of your clever and delightfully unkind reviews. All the ensembles in town live in fear. Keep up the good work. So, we now know this guy was like a critic, and he was known for being a pretty mean critic. Um, real quick, I also want to show off. Um, this costume, as you can see, it has an awesome electric effect going on the shoulder pad. Um, I'm not going to talk too much about it, but yeah, just in-game, this is what it looks like. And I think it's, it's it's still really cool. I mean, I would have preferred to have the, the different hat, but it's still really cool. The goggles are a cool touch, and it's just, I love it. Okay, so, if we inspect here, we see the window is shut, locked from the outsides, and there is no sign of a break-in. Okay, so there are ten clues to find throughout this entire place. Um, right here we found another letter. 
Okay, anonymous letter written in a feminine hand. My dearest Byron, I can't keep abreast of your innumerable affairs, but haven't you time for another little adventure with me? Cast aside your current parameter, much too working class for you, and join me in Florence, won't you? Hmm. I should return and find out about this. That is interesting. Um, Ervent communi communicating with the neighboring apartment. Hmm. Now that is interesting. That, considering that there's an air vent here, it is possible that someone could have just poisoned him through here. They could have just put something in the vents. Um, let's look at this light fixture. It's a common light fixture, but the light won't turn on. Another interesting effect. Oh, this is another cool thing. In this new version, whenever you look at anything that you've scanned, it will give you the name of the item and a little brief summary of what the item is about. So, you know, this is saying it's his body. And right here, it's a letter, and, it, and it's just a summary. Congratulations, harsh review. You know, so it reminds you of what it is, and it's really cool. I love this to death. It's just so cool. Yellow candles that have turned, that have burned down to the nub. That is very interesting. Okay. Um, this thing right here. The latest effort by the Aldrich Chamber Orchestra must be counted as a fiasco. The woodwinds were discordant and cacophonous. Rather than playing Mendels Mendelssohn, the strings fought with him. In particular, the solo performed by the first violin was a disaster. This gentleman is better equipped to perform in the London sewers. I would advise anyone who has contemplated attending to instead remain quietly at home. Wow, this guy is a prick. I understand why they killed him. I'm not saying I would kill him, but yeah. Okay, so they're implying here he's had an affair. Ooh. Now, you see, this is cool. It's one of the little tiny things you wouldn't notice unless you're using Eagle Vision. Okay, it's a concert program for a chamber orchestra that performed a series of Mendelssohn pieces a few nights ago. I should return and find out about this. Okay. So, as you can see, when you find out specific things, it actually unlocks new areas for you to check out. Which, you know, it's just, it, it's so cool because it actually gives you the ability to go and be a detective. So, um, you stand your door with lock and hinges in normal state. So, the door, there's no tampering, it's locked. Okay. I believe that's everything I can scan in this room, so let's talk to this chick out here. She's apparently the housekeeper. Oh, this is also new too. In, in um, Assassin's Creed Syndicate, with the, basically what happens is, when you talk to someone these words will appear over their head and then as you're like you can ask each question like I can ask right now about the guy in the room I'm just the housekeeper but Mr. Cashin was a dear friend each morning I bring him his coffee today his door was locked shut my husband is the caretaker we live downstairs we have the keys to all the apartments so after knocking mm -hmm. I became concerned and let myself in and found him like this <laughs> well, it's very clear that she's actually upset about this, but she could be faking. We don't know yet, but ba yeah, so the I'm going to continue. So about last night. My husband didn't want to waste any candles, so we retired early. Huh. Strange. Mr. Cashin is was a respected music critic. A very accomplished man. Okay. So this woman doesn't feel like a suspect at all. She's just you know, the way that she's been talking, it just kind of feels like she's saying, oh, you know, he was, like, she's very surprised about the fact that he's dead. So now we can go over here, which, this is the neighbor. Now, because we looked at the vents, we can actually now explore this place because it, become an, it becomes an available place. Okay, so as we can see, this air vent, possible way to poison someone. Okay. So, common light fixture, the light won't turn on. So it's obvious that all throughout the building light is not working. For some reason, the the lights aren't working anymore. Okay, let's inspect here. A candelabra of particularly burned white candles. I should return and find out about this. And you see, now we can go back, like, we can talk to people. Once we find out about specific things, we can then go back and talk to people. Um, let's talk, let's ask us eh, like that, about eh? the body. He lived right next door and often came home from his concerts a bit drunk and singing at the top of his lungs. Drove my wife near crazy. Hmm. 
Bob Vivon. Cashin had an eye for the ladies, no question. I was a bit jealous of him, frankly. <laughs> hmm. Okay, can you tell me about last I was night? down in the cellar, fiddling with my experiments. Okay. Now I can ask him about his experiments. I'm an amateur chemist. Henman let me set up a few experiments in the cellar. Now, see, because of that, I now have a new investigation zone down there. The basement and also Henman's room has been unlocked. Okay. So let's go over here. <coughs> Several articles, one about the Queen's plan to use a storage scepter with the dove tonight in industrialist. Another about the publishing business. A third concerning the Aldwych Chamber Orchestra, which has disbanded for lack of funds. A series of damning reviews by London's most influential critic has crushed all hope of attracting an audience. Wow, so this guy destroyed an entire orchestra. That seems like motive to me. But I have a feeling that it's not going to be the case. This this game, they like to do that. They'll have something that's like, it's very obvious, oh, it's this guy, you know. Something like that will happen. Like in this case, it's very obvious, it's the orchestra. Um, here's the music. I should return and find out about this. Okay. But see, here, now I can talk to him again. But yeah, they like to mislead you a lot of times. So I have a feeling it's not actually anything to do with the orchestra. This is something else. Okay, so tell me about Cashin. Mr. Cashin is dead. I just saw him yesterday. He looked in the peak of health. If you ask me, he paid a bit too much attention to the caretaker's wife. Scandalous, really. They must have seen each other nearly every day. So you're implying... So she's implying that they had an affair. Hmm. Which is possible, because we saw the affair letter. Okay, well, I'm going to ask her about last night. Last night, I was knitting in that chair. Then I felt quite sickly and opened the window to clear my head. I certainly didn't hear anything. She felt sickly. See, this is this is more proof to what I was saying. This makes more sense. It seems like it actually makes sense now that someone could have poisoned him. You know, like it's so interesting. I I love this. I love this entire mechanic because it actually lets you feel like a detective. I'm gonna ask you about when the, the candles. When the lights quit working yesterday, that sweet Mr. Golden handed out candles to everyone. He's such a nice man. He seems like a nice man. Oh! I'm actually done! I have everything filled out. I have all the investigations unlocked. Okay. So I'm gonna ask this guy about the sheet music now. That belongs to Mr. Golden. He's an awfully nice chap. We let him use our apartment during the day when my wife and I are out tending our shop. He likes to rehearse here where the light's better. Now you see, I'm pretty sure now that it's Mr. Golden. And as sad as that makes me feel, considering, you know, gold is me, um, you know, I, I, I'm probably going to guess it's him. Okay, tell me more about Cashin. <laughs> it's true. I loved him. He was the best thing that ever happened to me. <laughs> okay, so she was having an affair. The two of them were, you know, doing the bangies. And clearly that would make this man upset. David Golden. I worked very late. So did he. Okay. I only met him once or twice in the two years I've been living here. I don't need all the stuff to know that's you. He destroyed an entire orchestra. All those musicians put out of work. A rancorous old man who had no talent or creativity of his own. Okay, see, I have now figured it out. I there was more to that mystery than meets the eye. I'm going to look into it. Yeah, now see, I haven't... I yeah. didn't find the all the information. Are. Which, I think gives you a better score if you find everything. But, at the same time, I'm, I'm running out of time with this video, so I wanted to get it done and out of the way. Okay, so there we go. And, as you can see, I got new brass knuckles! Yay! Okay, so anyways, um, that's going to do it for this video. Please tell me if you want to see more of this. I love this game in the grappling hook. I feel like Batman. Yeah, this is the, I'll real quick show off the grappling hook mechanic. Basically, allows you to grapple up buildings like you just saw there. And also, allows you to do this. Yay. But anyways, that's going to do it for this episode. As always, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share this channel and the video with your friends. Tell me if you want to see more of this. I would love to do more of this if you guys are into it. 
Um, I'd love to do the Dreadful Crimes, but until then, I will see you guys next time. Okay, bye!